everyone, I just stopped recording my last video and I've literally, five seconds later, just started recording this video because I'm on that YouTube grind for you. Uh, in return, I'm gonna ask you to subscribe because I need it and I'm f***ing desperate. So that would be really kind of you. Today, we're gonna be having a look at some updated Alphaba drama because I'm so individual and unique and special. I think I've missed a lot, so I'm gonna have fun. It's not gonna be in any particular order, okay? In any chronological order. It's not a video essay. I just wanna watch Alphaba for my daily dose of hating my existence. And I'm gonna put you guys through it as well. It feels so cringe saying this, but my go-to TikTok account to get content on Alphaba is Mrs. Alphaba Exposed, because there's always just the best things on there, so. I want to be on that leaderboard this week. Don't you start thank chewing. You, thank you, babe. Don't I'm start chewing. I'm actually quite sad. Cause I haven't tried for it in months and... My team's like gone. I'm having the people that approach me for photos. Sending me love, like... I don't have to send me money in it, but... Like hearts and stuff. Stop. Know, thank you. Stop. Stop. I mean, my platform is. Stop! Oh my god! We're in the first clip, and she's already complaining about her team, how she's not on the leaderboard. I don't know what's been going on recently with the leaderboard. I don't follow it as much as it looks like I'm an obsessive little biatch. I don't follow that stuff. I don't. I only follow when she does multiple bad things and it, it you know it comes up on my for you page and i'm like here we go again why are you complaining still like surely you can fit the pieces together here and be like oh maybe people don't really like me and i'm not on the leaderboard and people aren't gifting me because i am a pos meaning piece of poop i'm really trying not to get demonetized uh because i'm desperate for that money give me gifts stop chewing <sighs> even if you sound like a penny that shows you support you know? Because yeah. I'm your entertainment, you know? I'm about me. I'm so sorry. To the people who are like me, who get genuinely really infuriated by chewing sounds, because I have this conversation all the time with my partner. I love him to bits, but even just hearing him chew slightly, it drives me off the edge so when i hear her chew and it's someone i don't like like the difference is i love my boyfriend all right so when he chews i'm like you're so annoying darling but when she chews i'm like you don't deserve anything people know elf on tiktok because of all the shit you've done i Just... want to be on that leaderboard this week also my headphones keep saying low battery so i'm praying you can't hear that what have i essentially done go give me the list is it 129 things i'll tell you what should we make my own list should we make a list of things i've done wrong so we'll make an actual real list of things I've done wrong and put it in perspective. And so she's making a list of the things she's done wrong. This is gonna be a long video, guys. So happy, happy, happy days for all of us right now. You get a long alpha video and I get sweet money coin. <laughs> I'm kidding, obviously. Everything truthfully, do you want to do it? Let's do it. You have to listen and you have to not come at me because I will tell you the full truth of everything, okay? Are you ready? Are you ready? Ready? Lied about uh, being diagnosed. Yes, I lied about that. Number two, Tourette's. Yes. This is the wild. The cancer thing. Xmas donations for phone. Card reader. Madonna. Pokemon cards. Seizures. Essay. Oh, essay. Okay. I was all in a goofy mood before. That's not funny. Number six on that list. You were created. That is insane. Like, I know the context of the video, right, is that she's listening to things she's so-called being accused of. To even, like, make that kind of, oh, yeah, like, I've been accused of SA. Like, that's not, that's not normal. And, like, you should have more sensitivity when it comes to talking about that because that is just weird she's such a scab why would you just even put that in why would you say that like if you've been accused of that then deal with the accusations deal with the accusations but do not drop that it's like a light-hearted thing like oh i fake tourette's like i'm not saying that tourette's being faked is like a not a bad thing but like putting that alongside sa is wild i hate this person i actually do yeah you know, i used to say in all my videos i don't hate her i just want her to change i actually just don't like you okay S H. 
panic attacks. Oh, benefits. Okay. Uh, pads. Period pads. Eye drawing. Okay. 13. MSP. Hormones. Okay. 50 pound subs. 50 pound sub. Manipulated media. The thing that I didn't understand with that list is is she listing things that she's supposedly done wrong, she admits she's done wrong, she's been accused of doing wrong, or some of them she did and some of them she didn't because she did some of those things, proven. Some of those things I didn't even know of. The essay I hadn't even heard of. So like, are you admitting you've done that? I don't understand here. I really don't understand. And do I want to understand moreover? Because the more and more I learn about this person, the more and more I sit here like, I know like that sounds like I'm like, it's the only way I can explain it. Hey guys. This is my friend. Hey y'all. Yo, 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 yo. What makeup are you doing? I'm doing, um, I'm using Morphe. Good. And Primark, <coughs> which is the same. Oh. And then I'm just going to put on some like concealer and stuff. I've got to do my nails as well, but I'm doing that really quickly. So guys, um, so this was a fan of mine on tit of TikTok, of my TikTok. A major fan. Honestly. And um, Jacob and I met last night in a nightclub, and we literally got on so well. I'm now become friends. So guys, it could be you. I'm not even shitting. Oh my god, it could be me. No, stop. I need that in my life. I need pain and turmoil and annoyance and just manipulation. I need all of those things, Alphabet. You know what? I automatically don't like him, and here's why. If you can willingly be a fan of Alphabet, knowing that everything that's happening, you are either one, very dislikable, I don't like you and you're stupid, or B, I'll let you off because maybe you're vulnerable in some way, shape or form. I'm going to assume, I can't actually assume either of them, but the fact that he says he was a fan and they met in a club and she's picked up a fan to be her friend is odd. All right, you know me, I speak about this all the time. I adore the people that watch me as a, as a concept, you know what I mean? I love the fact that I have people that I, I click on this video going, yes, you know when people comment, cataclysm uploaded, wake up, babe. I'm like, give me a warm, fuzzy feeling inside. All right, I love the people that watch me, I genuinely do, because it's just like, wow, you know? But I'm also not a f***ing weirdo, and I wouldn't pick up any of my fans from a club and, and then bring them to my house because that's weird and inappropriate. And I say fans, by the way, fans. I'm not saying I have fans, but she's refer... You know what I mean? She's... Re Shut up. But it, I wouldn't bring any of my viewers to my house because I am not weird and I don't want any accusations, even if it wasn't weird, even if I wasn't intending it to be weird, I wouldn't want to do that. Okay, yeah, moving on. I'm being serious. I'm always so nice. And she really is. Like, honestly, I like, and you've gotten so many vouchers now, like, the amount of people. Honestly, what? I'm the sweetest in real life. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. I don't give a f if you're sweet in real life. We've seen what you like on the internet, and it's the internet persona that we all see. We don't see what you like, Alphabet, in real life. I'm sorry, my heart's going kind of insane after the energy drink. Or maybe it's this video. It's really getting my, also in my eye as well. Right, anyway, continue. Uh, I just got, I just got used. Right. A man used me for views. It's my last call. Yeah. Yeah, Is he? Yeah, please. Yeah, please. Yeah, please. Yeah, please. Yeah, please. Um, so, so I'm a guy... Just give him a bit of pasture, and it goes like... Oh, no, don't worry, darling, honestly. Um, so a guy... So uh, he went... So, um, he kept pressuring me to go live with me. Yeah. And said, um... Kept pressuring me to go live. Stop pressuring me to go live. Go live, please. I really want that TikTok clout. Okay. Oh, God. How can you sit there and say, oh, I got pressure to go live when you're live 24-7? Like, I'm sorry. Saying you got pressure to go live is the funniest sentence I've ever heard. Like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> and also, talking about clout, like, you got used by a man for clout. Getting clout from Alphaba is like getting fame from Hitler. I, uh, I think I love you. Um, I want to date more. You've been playing on my feelings. Yeah. Am I sending to you? I don't want any. I just, I can't, I can't have my feelings played with at all. And he goes live with one of the worst enemies I have. One of the worst enemies. He went live with one of my ops. Gang signs. She went, she, yeah. The guy she was talking to went live with one of her enemies. 
How are you going to have enemies as a TikTok live streamer? How, how is that possible? How is that even working? And also, like, you know what I've just noticed is, like, if this was anybody else telling these dumbass stories, I would be like, this is boring as hell. I don't care. But have you noticed how every clip of Alphabet I actually find fascinating? There's rarely a clip that people post on TikTok where I'm actually sat there watching it, unless it's just, like, a video of her doing nothing, which... I mean, she doesn't do anything, but you know what I mean. I'll just... Was that, that Randy or...? No, no, it's Roger Carr. Oh, Ralph, yeah. But I met... Is she just telling this to random strangers? I like to think that she's just going up to the club when she's, like, streaming, like, telling people about her life story. I like to think that. And you know what? It would make sense. It would make sense because I guess you get so desperate for real-life validation when the entire, like internet despises you that you'd go around telling strangers like oh, oh oh you know what i mean okay i just want to ask you a question yeah why are you lying with these people who are who are like my enemies they're just requesting me i'm not no i don't know in it i've just left as soon as that they invited milan and the inspector and I no left. it's fine it's fine so um i'll, I'll tell you about be aware that. of what what what's actually who who you don't no, it's like fine, it's fine i'll tell you i'll tell you about these people so um inspector watches me for 12 hours straight. No, we, no, we spoke about the inspector. I, I'm aware. Yeah. That's why I just left as soon as he think it. But what, what's with the Mama Kaz and Milan? Like, this is what I don't know. Because oh, originally, oh. it was Mama Kaz that invited me and then she got Milan. I don't know who the these people are, but I've seen this thing about the inspector. The inspector, I think, is someone who streams Alphaba's content so you can watch her content without giving her support. I'm pretty sure that's them. And it's just kind of funny because, like, I get where Elf was coming from. Like, I get it's, like, a bit obsessive and weird. But at the same time, I don't really care. Like, either way, like, whatever, you know? It's just funny to me because apparently Elphaba reckons that she got the inspector kicked off TikTok because she has connections to TikTok. How delusional have you got to be? But then again, I also think, like, I get why people... Sorry, the Hello Kitty in the background is kind of throwing me off. I get why you would think you've got connections if you've been allowed to stay on this long after all the things you've done. So I guess that kind of does figure. Something kind of just drew out of the blue. Just made me 36 pounds. I didn't know she could draw, to be fair. I'm a money-making machine. <gasps> I love it. <laughs> yeah, a money-making machine, except it's the ATM on the side of the road that every time you walk past, whispers in your ear, get money, draw money out from me. Get money from me, you know you want to. Yes. And if you want a piece of art in the future, I'll absolutely do it. Absolutely will do it for you. How many of you would buy my drawing? I might do another one. I might do another one, not tomorrow, but I might do another one next week. Like once a week, I might sell a little drawing off to someone. Stay tuned. 1.5k likes on this video, and I'll buy a drawing from Alphaba. Maybe. We'll do it on weeklies. Get on the reset, get on the weeklies. That's a perfect way to get on the weeklies and sell my art. Yeah. I'm gonna sell my crap art to make more money, to get on the leaderboard to make more money. She really is on that grind. You know what? Respect. Because I can't lie. You know what? Get on that money grind, queen. Don't, don't do it. Oh, cute though. You're a bully, Kate. You're a bully. I don't care. I'll bully you as well. Piss off. I know, I know actually this would sell. Someone actually buy this off me. I know for a fact it would sell. 25 pounds. Are these real prices? I want real price. I'm not going to be looking for anything else. I know you're not meant to shit on artists because, like, you know, artists. But, like... £20, Grace says. 25 35 I write your name as well on it. I would buy it to wipe my eyes. She's giving. Also, why is why are these two together? This was in Liverpool, right? F me, I stayed in the entire time these two were in Liverpool and Paul Breach. I hid. Yeah, I, I live in Liverpool as a student, so when they when I was informed that these two were on the loose, best believe I didn't set foot outside. Hello everyone. <laughs> I've never been to Liverpool before, but let's give us a shot. No, stop. Why is she talking like that? She literally legit thinks she's a celebrity. I'm surprised she felt safe in Liverpool because, like, if I was her, I wouldn't... I would not come outside. I wouldn't. Liverpool scares me on the best of days and, like, yeah. Oh, my God, this is such a crazy story. I've never sang in Liverpool before. Oh, what song could it be? Oh, it is 
justifying gravity. I actually didn't know. It took me a while. So, since the 18 plus talk was on, I'll tell you what my type of guy is, and you could, like, tell me if you're the right fit. Okay, so, my type of guy <laughs> is a guy who is confident. I like a confident guy. Confidence mm -hmm. is key. Confidence is key, a million percent. Confidence. Um, good personality. Someone who I can like talk to and can be my best friend. I love that. So someone who can be like best friends with me. Um, who, do you know who can drive? If you can drive a car, I'm already, I just love that. I love the control. Like I love like, hi, can I just get in the car and you can drive me? I like a guy who can sing or do like drawing. I like that kind of guy. I like anyone like in the performing arts that likes to draw, likes to, like, I want someone I could sing with, you know what I mean? Kind of like that. What else? A guy who's not an asshole, who doesn't judge me, and who doesn't take advantage as a, like, basically, like, someone who won't use me. Has good communication skills, so sort of, like, who is a good talker, like, who's, like, a light of the party, like, a party animal. He essentially just described, like, everybody's dream person. Like, all the qualities she's describing there are genuinely just, like, good qualities to have in a partner. I would say, Alphaba, to maybe reevaluate a little bit there based on your personality type, kind of the personality category that you fall into, I'm going to say. So, yeah, carry on. Time. I need to go on my out of you. Do you Well, I'm in Manchester, so if you want a slice of me... Ah! Sorry. So Sorry. Uh, no, obvious. I'm not jo I'm not even playing up for YouTube. That actually... That provoked a core reaction in me. So my heart is now beating really fast. And uh, you know what? Maybe it is the caffeine. But it's a combination, because f*** me. That was not fun. He has to have a six-pack. He has to have, like, sort of a six-pack. But, like, kind of, like, he goes to the gym, so he's, like, healthy... I'm like good looking and I kind of Elf, bro, I'm not a man, but I do f***ing work out. So I don't know if, um, I don't know if, <laughs> hit me up, baby girl. Don't, ever. We can drive a car and then we can get married. And... <laughs> she said, can, anyway. she said, can drive a car twice. B date a f***ing taxi driver then. Oh, uh, yeah. And then someone who can like cook, because I, I can't. <laughs> Everything, got like girl, like I've got a man that's near damn perfect. Okay, I've got a boyfriend who's basically perfect, but even he has his flaws. He can't drive. <laughs> if he's watching this, he can't. No, he can cook. He can cook actually. He just can't drive. So I would send him your way, Alpha. But but to be honest, he's not good enough for you. He's not. He edits these. He edits the audio for these. So uh, hello. Cook for you. I'm not going to be the wife of the house. You can cook yourself, love. No, that's slay. Um, that's slay. That's slay. Like like so I'm slay. not having that in that I mean can't be asked to be put in the kitchen. <laughs> that's real. Should we talk about men? Now I wanna see. So basically Do you know what this is? Real or fake? You guess. I'm gonna say fake. Trick question. Real or fake? It's not a trick question, it's just a question. Oh, people are actually thinking it's Oh, people say it's fake. Oh. Oh, this is a poll. I would like to say the answer is... Real. Yeah, I'm going to say it's fake considering you're a TikToker. I'm not going to I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not even going to bullshit and say that. She probably earns more than me. Like, I don't... Like, not... I don't want to start talking about money, obviously, but, like, she, pro she does earn more than me. That's a fact. It kind of makes me a bit sad. I'm not going to lie. Maybe I should start doing this. This is a fake one. Yes, this is fake. And this was... It came with a bag, so it was, like, probably, like... Not that much. I got all my Louis Vuitton at, like, home. But it's all fake. I don't There's care. There's only one thing I bought that was real, and it's a pass. But it was, it was £560, that one. Does anyone else really not understand the hype of fake 
branded stuff. I'm not really a branded person per se. I like my occasional branded things. You know, like I've got my branded razor headphones. I'm not like a massive brand person, especially not Louis Vuitton, Gucci. I find them kind of ugly. And like, you can say, oh, say you're broke without saying you're broke. Like, yeah, okay, I am broke, but that's not the point. I just really don't like them. I don't. And like, maybe, maybe if I had unlimited money, it would be different because maybe some of them are good looking products, but nah, not for me. I think it's an ego thing a lot of the time, I'm gonna be honest, which makes sense with Alphaba. This one, real or fake? Why am I watching this? I don't want to play this game. <laughs> Skip. I get a PO box. Would you want me to get a PO box? No. Oh, God, that'd be crazy. Why is this video only about all the money that she wants to earn? Like, I... I uh, Everything I've seen so far is about... Sorry, I just got distracted. Um, my boyfriend's mum, absolutely love her, lovely woman, um, sent us this. <laughs> Basically, um, grass... Grass is... Gr Wait, look. See that? It's growing little pubes. You can barely see. It's a grass head. It's from Spain. So, anyway, um, all the videos on here are just money-based. I don't care. Shut up. Uh, like, can you do something interesting with your life, please? So... I would, do you know what I'd love to do? I'd love to unbox the stuff you send me, like letters of things like oh, that. Oh, like, do would, you really would... think, do you really think that's a good idea? As someone who is not very liked by the majority of the internet, putting your PO box on the internet to ask people to send you stuff sounds like you're asking for, like, dog poop to be delivered to you in, like, a box. I really wouldn't do that if I were you. Literally, not even kidding you, I would unbox... <laughs> People will send you the one or two diseases that you have not yet contracted, if that's entirely possible. Letters, I'd read them, I'd, before I open them on live, I'd just check if they were like hateful or stuff like that, you know, or any jokey ones, because we ain't gonna have that on live. But, so if you do send me a PO box and, you, and we end up doing it, I will always make sure the hate ones are not in the live, that I'll throw them in the bin. But the good ones... So you're going to open them before... That's not even a PO box opening then, is it? I know I get a lot of Is you so showing the good ones you've already got? It's always good to be careful. But stuff like this, do you guys, like, enjoy the positivity? Like No, I don't. Another video where she's talking about coming out with stuff where she can make money. I can't do this anymore. I actually can't. I'm really starting to, like, just lose my will. Lose my fucking will. If you get one that says, like, smell fubber, I might buy it. <laughs> Like, I personally, like... Why she do that, like, sound, that nasally sound? Like, do you have problems? Thing, like, you know, any hate comment I get, like, I don't get it in real life. Like, people are so sweet to me. How many of you guys have, like, missed my live streams like that? Oh, I'm my God, me, person. me, me, me. How many of you agree I'm a strong... I have not had it easy on this app, have I? Put, put... Okay, I'm gonna just... I'm gonna just talk about something right now. I've not had it easy on this app, right? I have a viewer, and I don't know if she's going to watch this, and her name is May. And um, May suffers from a rare type of cancer, and she constantly updates her story. I follow her Instagram where she talks about her... She talks about her life. She talks about her struggle, her battles with cancer. She is... I think she's 19, 18. She's basically a little bit younger than me, maybe Alphaba's age. May is like the strongest person I have ever met. She's absolutely incredible. And every time I see May post about her battle with, with cancer, I am like, it like pause, like it feels like it pauses my, my life. Like I sit there and I see it and I, it makes me think about how lucky most of us are and how privileged we all are and how awful some of the best people have it. When I watch people like Alphaba talk about how strong she is, <laughs> oh, it really angers me. And I only mention May because May has been um, a viewer of mine for uh, quite a long time and um, she posts the most inspirational things about her journey and I'm going to ask obviously permission for me to even include this and uh, link her account in the description below for you to go follow um, she's incredible she's a lovely girl I've spoke to her once before an incredible incredible woman and you've got people like Alphaba who make me sick talking about how strong you are shut the f*** up um, so yeah that's just a quick little shout out to me absolutely love her um, I just, I wish her the best of luck as well with, with her journey. And, um, it's hard to find what to say really. Uh, but yeah, uh, go follow her, give her support. Just, just watch what she posts, read what she posts, show her a bit of love. Um, yeah, if you're watching May, uh, you're a great person and 
Uh, you are the definition of strong, not this clown, okay? All right, gang, I think I've had enough of that for now. I'm gonna be perfectly honest. Uh, she really just destroys my brain. She really does. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you have enjoyed, like and subscribe. 70% of you aren't subscribed and that is a crime, okay? And I'm not gonna do an alphabet and, and beg, uh, except I am, so please subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. So cool.